In this video, we are learning how to find uncertainty using Excel. The formula for the uncertainty is a standard deviation of the sample divided by the square root of the number of data points. The Excel function looks something like this. So let's get started. So let's type the standard deviation here. So before I use any formula in Excel, I need to type the equal sign and then I start typing standard deviation and there are quite a few suggestions here. I like to use standard deviation for the sample, not the standard deviation for the population. And then I need to enter the range of the data. So in this case, my data is in the cell located for example E2 to E9 so I can manually type it uh, or I can just select the first one and then hold the shift key and the select rest one so as you can see it shows you the range and now I close the parenthesis and hit the enter sign and that gives me the standard deviation so next step is to just find the uncertainty from that standard deviation so that means all I need to do is I need to again type equal sign select the standard deviation I already calculated and divide that by the square root of the number of data points and in this case we have eight data so I'm going to be using this number eight and then close the parenthesis hit enter and there is uncertainty let's also calculate the average of the data because we're going to be using this a lot so for this i start by typing equal sign and then i type average or choose average from the list and then type the range this time e2 e9 and hit the close parenthesis as you can see the data is highlighted now so that means we are calculating the average of all this data hit enter and there is average 